they've been recording and what do you know? All right, so better late than never. Better late than never. All right, so if you're just trying to miss our Superman stuff, then there's been no worries. All right, so we got uh, upright rows to front raises. First set. You go upright row into front raise. And then three, two, and one. Let's go up, down, up. Here, one, good. Nice work. Good. Three, good work. Four. Five, we got 10. Six, lovely job, come on. Seven, three more. Eight, last two. Nine, final one. And 10, great job. Drop the 10 on the next one. Let's that one. Good work. Good work, everybody. Nice work. So that was our first set. That was our first set. Well done. Good execution. We got one down, two more to go. Set up and get ready for that in a few seconds. All right, let's do this. Round two. Ten more reps. Ten more reps, everybody. Let's go in five, four, three, two, and one. Let's go. Up, down, and out. Good. One. Good. Two. Okay, we're extra light. I'm telling you, ten. I know you said. Let's go. Good job. Good. Row up and up. Five, good. Six. Seven, great job. Eight, two more. Nine, last one. And ten, well done, great job. Yeah, you still feel it. Yeah. Good job, everybody, good job. Last set, best set. Last set, best set, challenge set. Yes, yes challenge set, absolutely, great job. Great bra, great job. All right, we are looking good. We are looking good. That's set, best set. So challenge round this, challenge round this. We're just gonna add two reps on these, so we're going to 12 this time. We're going to 12 on these. That's set, best set for 12. Everyone ready? Round three for 12. And three, two, and one. Let's go. One. Two. Three. Four. Good. Five, six, we're halfway, come on. Seven, beautiful, come on. Eight, keep pushing. Nine, three more. And last two. Eleven, last one. And twelve, great job. Great job, great job, great job. Well done. Excellent work. Yes, ouchie, yes. <laughs> Excellent job. All right, so that was really good. That was really good. We're going to move into our next movement now. So far, so good, everybody. We're going to do some static shoulder breath. So, those are going to look like this. Keep on some dumbbells. We're gonna start up right here. So that's our starting point, staying up here. Those weights do not come from here. All right, first hand is gonna be left. We're gonna come down up for five. We're gonna go up and down. <laughs> right here for five. And then boom, up and down for five. All right, that's our movement. So we got five, five, and five. 
Everyone ready? I'm sorry, Coach. You, you froze. I'm sorry. Can you show me one more time? I apologize. All right. So we got five, five, and then five. All right. Five left, five right, five together. All right. Everyone ready? Here we go. Step number one. Good. Three, two, one, let's go. Down to the air straight up. One, two, three, four, five, and one, two, three, four, five. Both together. One, good. Two, three, keep pushing. Four more, Lori, and five. Great job. Great work. Well done, well done, and well done. Good job. Perfect work. Good start, good start, good start. Good first set. Excellent job. We got one down, two more to go. So set two coming up. Step two coming up. Everyone ready? Back into position for step number two. And here we go. Same movement. That's right, starting position up in the air. Good, all the way up for extension. Here we go in five, four, three, two, and one. Let's go, press up. One. Two, three, four, five. Leave it up. One, two, three, three, four, five. Both together. One, two, good. Three, come on. Four, good, and five. Well done. Great job. Good work, everybody. Great work. Last set, best set, challenge set. Yes, last set, best set, challenge rep. All right, so we did five and five. We're just gonna add a couple once again. So we're gonna go seven, seven, seven this time. All right, two reps, two extra reps. We got this, we got this, we got this. Two extra reps. Easy peasy. Easy peasy, I like it. That's my language, that's my language. Easy peasy. Uh-huh. <laughs> Good. All right, so here we go. Last round. Seven, seven, seven. Easy. Oh, last one. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. All right, let's do this thing. I'll put it upside down. All right, here we go. All right. <laughs> Three, two, and one. Let's do this. One, two, three. Four, good. Five. Remember you're doing seven. Remember you're doing seven. Good. Seven. Good. And let's go outside. Good. Come on. Keep your hand up. Good. I know it wants to drop. Good. And both. Let's go. Pretty strong. Good job. That's it. Nice work, Rita. Good, Lori. Guns. I see them guns, Lori. I see them guns. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Yes. Woo! Beautiful job, everybody. Beautiful job. My muscles are screaming. Yes. <laughs> Good job. Well done. Well done. Well done. All right. Awesome work. Awesome work. Getting it in. Getting it in. All right. So our next movement here is going to be bent over rows. We're going to keep our two dumbbells. We're going to hold them at the side. Bag and snatch. Pass if you want. To have our hand extended, we can go up and up. So the key thing, try to keep that head, try to keep that head up, that's why so we're gonna be one, two, so I'll three to the side. One, two, right, bring that elbow up and back. Right there, all right? So here we go. All press. All right, let's do this. 12 reps, everybody. 12 reps. In three, two, and one. 
let's go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, and twelve. All right, good work. So we are on the next one. You're standing up here. I want you to. You're still kind of standing upright for me. I want you to bend that back. All right. So it's almost like a right here. You want to have that back bend and stay here. Okay. Don't. I don't want to come here. All right. So down here, bending at the waist. All right. Good job. So set two. Set two. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I can do it. Fine. So let's get ready. Set number two. Coming up. So let's get ready. Set number two. Coming up. Twelve more reps. Grab your dumbbells. And here we go for 12. Everybody ready? 12 reps. In three, two, and one. Let's go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, and 12. Great job. Well done. Excellent work, everybody. Last set, Two. best set, challenge set. Challenge set, indeed. Good work. Look at that. Time flies. Let's go. Great job. Doing it well. All right, so we got 15 on this last one, everybody. 15. Last set, best set. 15 reps. Everyone ready? And here we go. 15 reps. In five, four, three, two, and one. Let's go. Good. That's it, really much better. Good. Yes, yes, yes. Right there. Good. That's it. Perfect form. Now you got it. Right down. Nice, Lori. Good work. Good. Good, keep that elbow tight, keep the elbows tight against your body. Good work. Good, that's it. Good. And squeeze. That's right. That's right. Good job. Excellent job. Well done. Good work, everybody. Great job. Great job. Great job. All right. So far, so good. So far, so good. We're getting ready to move into our next movement here. We got some lateral raises this time around. So it's gonna be our lateral raises right here. All right, one. So you're gonna bend at the elbows. You're gonna bend at the elbows. So your elbows are gonna be like this as you come up. All right, so it's one. Don't keep the hands straight. Good, just like that. Yes, 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 Serena. Catch the perfect. All right, so it's gonna be coming up. And as you come up, try and point the thumbs down and pick these up. All right, so it's gonna be like this. You're gonna point those, turn that wrist so the thumb go down. I want you to isolate that shoulder. All right? All right, so here we go. We're gonna go for a total of 12 here. 12 breaths. Everyone ready? 12 breaths, lateral raises in three, two, and one. Let's go. One, two, again, point those thumbs down, pick these up. Three, good. Four, five, good, that's it. Six, seven, Eight, beautiful, that's it. Nine, 10, two more, 11, last one, and 12, great job. All right, excellent work, excellent work. Beautiful, so far so good, so far so good, everybody. Nice work. Two down, one more to go. Oh, that's the first time, that's the first one, my bad. <laughs> one down, two to go. Don't forget your water, guys. Yes, right, right over here. 
Good work. One down, and two to go. Rocking and rolling. No, my son is messaging me because he's probably trying to buy something on the car and found out if he could. Yeah. yeah, I blocked it. Uh -huh. No, because uh, there was a, some, a lot of fraudulent papers on my side. Oh. Well, I, I cut it off. But his car connected to mine. <laughs> so, yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, right. Yeah, yeah. I was like, look at all this. I was like, what? So I cut off. On that. All right, set number two. Twelve reps. Second step. In three, two, and one. Let's go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 11, 12, beautiful work, great job, now to our last step, best step, hey Tammy, we just best have step, best step, challenge set, last step, best step, challenge set, coming up, we got this, we got this, so our challenge, we're going to go 18 reps, I like that number 18. You put that 18 up and now it's, you know, it's forever ahead soon. So we got yeah, yeah. 18 reps, challenge round. We're gonna do 18 reps. We got this, we got this. We're hitting it for 18 on this last one, everyone. Let's get it done. 18 reps. Last set, best set. Final exercise, 18 reps. Here we go. Three, two, and one. Let's go. One, two, hey, Karen. Three, four, good. Hello, Five, everyone. Six, Hi, seven, eight, good. Ten more. Ten, nine. Oh, yes, sir. Six. I'm oh, sorry. Seven. All right, now we got it. Six, five, four, three, two, one more, and one. Oh, well done. Did that thing away from you? All right. That really started to burn at the end there. Great work, everybody. Great work. Excellent. All right, so it is that time of day. We finished up a tough workout. We get to celebrate here a little bit. Turn that music up. And let's have some fun. Everybody whining. Everybody lining. And you see we Often imitated. Never, never, never duplicated. DJ Mello B. Pull it down on the wrist. All right. 
So we're gonna come right here. Stand down, pull down on that wrist. All right, really kind of get a nice stretch there. Stretch out those biceps and triceps. All right, we asked to do a little work just now. All right, go to the other hand. And again, same process. Good work, good work, good work. Good, all right, we're gonna bring it across. Excellent. Good, stand the other way. Really good, everybody, nicely done. Good, all right, so now we're gonna do a reader. I, I, we call this the reader. So we got the, we got to do this right here, try to reach down the back. <laughs> this is how you do reader. <laughs> I call this the reader, so we're gonna do this. <laughs> We're gonna stretch out back here. We're gonna try to touch that hand back there. Keep the elbow 90 degrees up in the air. We're trying to really feel that stretch go into the back. Good. As you can see, I'm way away from my hand. But I've gotten better. I used to be down here, so. All right, so, all right, other side. And one side always seems to be a little bit more flexible than the other. Good. Good, see how Rita did that right away? She knows what this is all about. All right, so, good, great job. All right, so legs apart. Now let's reach down, pushing back with the hips. Yeah, touch the floor here if you can. Exhale down. And let's inhale up. And stretch it out toward the ceiling. Exhale down. Lovely, good job. Inhale up for me one more time. Reaching it up and out. Good, and exhale down. Good work, good work, good work. Bring your feet together for me. Now we're just gonna try and bring that knee up a little bit. Stress the legs out. Good, good, give it a nice little pull. Good job, good, that's it. Well done everybody, good. Give me a couple more. And one more, good work. All right, excellent work. Well done, everybody, well done. Congratulations, high five. You did perfect today, I love it. Way to get on in here and get that work in today, Laurie. <laughs> Great job, Kieran, thanks for hopping on in here at the end, I love it. You know, showing up is good, no matter what time of the day it is. I'm glad you joined us here. Dawn, Lori, Dr. Delise, and of course, Rita. Welcome back from Oahu. <laughs> good stuff, good stuff. And, Ken, and of course, our good friend Shanique here. Yeah, jumping on in, getting in, getting her work in, getting her work in. All right, so excellent today. Um, as we did uh, those movements there, you know, I, I, I um, Lisa always says, what's the, what's the most uh, challenging thing that you, you overcame today and during the course of this exercise. Uh, I'll tell you what it was for me. Uh, it was, um, and maybe because I did a, a bunch of them earlier, but even when I did it the first time, I felt it was those those new versions of the Supermans, right? When we when we start here in the Superman, we come up and then extend and go back down, right? So it was up and then bend and extend and down. So that was that was tough, right? It really worked the lower back. And you really felt the, the muscles in the upper back work. Those of you watching the recording, you may not have seen that because I, typically me, I hit the record button late. But you can try it on your way now. You can try it um, and get those in, all right? So you can do a couple of sets of those, all right? So, um, but uh, definitely, definitely uh, good for the lower back in particular. If you've got lower lower back issues, it really works on strengthening the lower back. Then you're going to just lie supine, starting on the, with your hands like in a cross position. You're going to come up, raise the back up. And you're going to bend the elbows. You're going to extend out, come back down, hands out, and down. All right? So that's going to be your movement. All right? You're going to do that for a total of eight reps. All right? You're going to do two sets of eight and then try 10 on the last one if you can get there. But great work. Great job, everybody. Nicely done. Nicely done. All right. So we're going to get into our mindful question of the day. All right? Uh, type in chat a couple of reasons why. Uh, you're optimizing your wellness is important to you, right? And and that's a that's a good question. Uh, why is, has optimizing your wellness, getting back on track with your with your wellness, and, and wellness can be mental, physical, 
and nutritional. And why is that important to you at this stage of your life? Um, it should be all the time, but for some people, it's a new, it's a new, it's a new muscle, right? It's a new muscle we're developing, um, focusing on our wellness. And it's because sometimes life takes over. Like the sometimes life gets in the way, right? We got we got busy schedules, you know. Um, we got kids, we got jobs, you know, all those things that high demand, high demand of our time. And what happens? What mostly gets neglected is us, right? We we neglect. We neglect staying focused on the thing that's most important, which is our health, right? Until we're reminded of it, usually by our bodies. And then the doctor says, oh, well, you know, you're in dire need of getting yourself back together, all right? Um, but well, we're working to curtail that and send, in some cases to avoid it, right? So, and the key way, the way to do that is to do exactly what we're doing, which is to get ourselves moving, um, you know, doing, doing the small things uh, that act, over time add up. Right, um, and and that's exactly what's happening. Anybody else? Anybody? Uh, let's see. I need to, I need to be well for, for dawn uh, because I'm here to be an example in the world. And I can't do that huffing and puffing and being tired all the time. And plus, it's for you, exactly, exactly, right. So at the end of the day, you want a good quality of life. I, I keep stressing that, right? Quality of life is so important. Right? Um, it's not enough to just be alive. Um, you know, if you're alive and, and every day is painful and every day is, is a struggle. Uh, because your health is deteriorated, then that quality of life is not conducive to you being happy. But but if you if you if you keep yourself strong and that that strong being um, keeping your body strong um, and and eating properly, those things will help you to have an a, a optimized quality of life. And that that's really what it is, right? Laurie says to feel good now and be well in my senior future. So yeah, exactly. Vitality and longevity. So living a long life. Makes no sense if, if you if you if you can't do simple things, right? Um, like make a cup of coffee. Like Laurie's having a cup of coffee right now. Some people struggle to make a cup of coffee, right? That, that's there's tracks, right? They need somebody to bring it to them, and and that's not to take away from some people. Sometimes that happens. Sometimes sometimes you help just things happen in life, but but there are some things we can avoid by 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 standing in the gap, right? By standing in there and doing what we need to do to try to keep our bodies as strong and well as possible. And if life happens, life happens. But but we can avoid certain things by, by trying to, to stay as strong as possible, eat as well as possible. Um, and, I, and I tell people, I don't ever tell you not to have something, but but you can have something like those treats and sugars and all the other stuff, you know, uh, that's, that's my addiction, right? And I just found out how big an addiction sugar really is. Sugar is like probably the most addictive thing there is out there. It's probably more addictive in some cases than, than those major drugs, pharmaceuticals, like hot heroin and those type of stuff. People are addicted to sugar and don't even realize it, right? Um, and, and so, you know, I'm not saying don't have it, but just like anything else, you have it in moderation. Be aware, just have an awareness, awareness of what it is that you're taking in. Um, and you know when you're having too much of something, you know, subconsciously, you know, um, this is too much. And so in those moments, take a moment, re reflect. If I've, had, if I've had two cookies already and I got six more to eat, then I know I probably shouldn't eat those six more cookies. All right, I've had two, then walk away. Take a deep breath, walk away, think about it for a second, decide if it really is something you want to have or it's just a craving, all right? And you take that moment and, and, and regroup. And chances are, if you really think about it, you probably say, you know what? I really don't need that, that third, fourth, fifth, sixth cookie. I, I, <laughs> Uh, and and sometimes you know what helps. Sometimes you just chew it really slow and just enjoy it. Savor it. I'm not saying you can't have, it, but savor it. If you're gonna have it, then savor it. Savor that. Savor that first one. And sometimes it's just that you just want that taste. And if you savor that first one, that the 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 craving reduces, and you're able to just say, okay, I've I've had what I wanted, and I don't need to have it. Just keep going, keep going, keep going. That's where the issue comes in. So sometimes you take that through um, and it just kind of slow down, slow down and enjoy it, savor it. Take, take 20 chews to eat a cookie, you know? Um, and you'll find that that craving diminishes because your body just really wants to taste the flavor. Um, and, and you get it in and, and, and that craving reduces and it's gone. And, and you're able to stay on track, stay on course. And also remember, if you do get off course, it's not the end of the world, all right? It's not the end of the world. Don't beat yourself up. Right? That's what we do a lot of times. We start to beat ourselves up. We feel guilty. Uh, and then that's when that's when the binging comes in because we give up. Right. So so if we just relax and, and just say, OK, all right, I can reset. Uh, uh, I messed up today. 
Um, I'll get back on track tomorrow. And, and just, as long as we do that, you're okay. As long, all right, Shanique, you got to go. All right, I see you. All right. Yes, yes, Don, exactly. Sugar is, a, is an addiction. Um, looking for healthy alternatives, yes. And, and, and be careful, though, because a lot of times those sugar substitutes, sometimes they're worse than the actual sugar, right? If you, if you look at, at some of the ingredients in those things, uh, or whether, the way they make it, the, the chemical stuff uh, sometimes does more damage uh, than just having the sugar, right? So, so sometimes it's just easier to just moderate it. Uh, just just have a little less of the sugar. Like for instance, I, I like coffee just like Lori, but instead of having instead of putting uh, three spoonfuls of sugar, I'll, I started reducing it. Now now I do I did two, and then I can just now put one spoonful in there and shake it and stir it around. I'm good, right? Um, and and so sometimes it's the small little adjustments we make, and those add up over a course of time. So if I if I reduce two sugar two spoons with the sugar to one, I just took probably about I don't know 150 calories out of my diet. And if I drink coffee every day, you know, think about that cumulatively. That's that's a one, two, that's that's four, that's five. I don't know about 800 calories. I just took out of my out of my diet per week, right? Just by that one small adjustment. Uh, and just imagine how cumulative that, that adds up over the course of time. So so you just do those little small adjustments, and you'll find um, that yeah, dates. So something sweet, exactly. Uh, mushroom coffee, uh, dates. Yeah. So those will give you that that sense of having something sweet. Absolutely. Right. It's a natural source of sweetness. All right. I love it. Way to, way to go, Dawn. So just make small adjustments and those add up over the course of time to, to get you the way you want to be. And then you'll soon be surprised at how much of a big effect that has uh, as you go through it. So so keep that in mind um, and always, always be conscious. And again, you know, we're all going to have our moments. I've been doing this. Oh, I don't know. 18, 20 years, I think I've been doing fitness stuff uh, and I still on occasion have my moments where I, where I just, I know I do bad. I, I go eat a big slice of cheesecake or something like that. But you know what? Uh, I understand that, okay, I had the cheesecake. So that means tomorrow I got to do a little something extra. And I know that I can't have that, can't have that cheesecake until further down, right? I, I know I've had that cheesecake now. It can't be tomorrow having the same thing that the next day I'm having the same thing. So I understand that, okay, I've had my, I treated myself. So now I also treat myself by, by balancing it up. It's all, everything is in balance. Everything is in balance. All right. Well, thank you, everybody. I appreciate you. I'll see you all tomorrow. We got another great session coming our way tomorrow morning, 9 a.m. Right and early. Get ourselves geared up for that. And um, and uh, let's be ready for it. Let's be ready for it. So let's uh, let's open up and say say until next time. Remember, Darchi, I think that's what the exact <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Coach. Hey, Thank Rita. You Coach. Bye, Rita. Bye, Bye, Rita. Bye, Coach. Bye, 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 Bye,